Alright our kid. Alright, so I'm only up to I'm gonna put these two on here. Sacrificial pieces. Positive, negative. So the positive goes onto the blue. Negative goes on to the brown, or whichever way you do it yourself. Twiddle twiddle. Obviously, I'll plug that in and then I can adjust it there. Um, you can use a car battery charger, I think the older ones. This one I've got here is just it's for controlling um, railway tracks. I don't have any railway tracks. I bought this because it was cheaper than a battery charger. Power controller. These um, electrodes need to be kept apart, so I've got a little block of wood which fit one second ago, and you saw me take it out. I'll wedge that in there, that'll stop them touching the part, and then. Somehow. There we go. And now I can go in without touching the sides and without touching the Cathode, anode, either or. One of them's the cathode, one of them's the anode, according to the Google. Here's one I made earlier. Need to add some sodium carbonate. About a smash amount. Oops. That looks about right. I need something to mix it with. Dun dun, dun dun, dun dun, dun dun, dun dun, dun dun. I'll probably insert some jazz music instead of. Let's go by that. Jump cut. Oh, I'm so glad I did that right the first time. Fully submerged. And then we connect the negative. So, try again. That's better. Thanks for watching the short video where I made this electrolysis machine for a future project. If you like this video, look in the description, you'll see 
I'll put a little description of all the bits that I used on there and also my social media pages Facebook Instagram and I've got patreon patreon if you want to keep if you want to help me keep me, me making more of these videos if you look here you'll see this wrench finished off and if you look here I'll probably have some other concoctions of restoration videos this will be where my uh, subscribe button is and then I'll put my patreon button here always thinking thanks for watching Oh, <laughs>